This morning I was listening to the Today Show and I heard a wonderful story about music and a music program that was helping children with autism. And it reminded me of a story I recently heard about a dear mother who had a daughter who was autistic and the daughter um, created quite a lot of havoc with her mom and with the family standing on tables if they went out to restaurants and so forth. And I heard this mother um, say that when her daughter was really good, she would sit her on her lap and sing, You Are My Sunshine. And on the days when she was particularly ornery, she would sing to her, One Day at a Time, Sweet Jesus. So I want to talk a little more about the lyrics to both of those songs, because I think they're particularly relevant um, not only for us to have gratitude for mothers of special needs children, but also just for us to have gratitude as we're working our way through and toward the end of this pandemic. Jimmy Davis was the original author of the lyrics of You Are My Sunshine around 1939, but you can see there are many other persons who've written different verses, and I've put a few of the verses by other authors in this video for you to review. Uh, the main words, the main lyrics are, You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. And I can just envision that mom singing this to her little daughter um, during the good days. Um, here's some other lyrics. I'll always love you and be there for you. I'll protect you from harm's way. Because I adore you. You're my dream come true. You're my beautiful sunshine. What a lovely sentiment that a mother gives to her daughter with special needs to calm her and comfort her. Now on those tough days when the mom sang one day at a time, sweet Jesus, I also looked up those lyrics. And um, they were written by Mary John Wilkin and Chris Christopherson maybe somewhere around 1948 or so. Um, many other, maybe up to 200 artists have also sung this. It's an old gospel. Um, but I saw a uh, Mr. Tilly um, record it with his 93-year-old mother. And I assume the daughter's in their singing harmony. And it was just priceless. And I want to play a little clip for you. <laughs> So today, I want to remind you, let's have gratitude for mothers of special need children and also for the lyricist of these wonderful old songs. Listen to the words that we just heard. Yesterday's gone and tomorrow may never be mine. I think it's really applicable during this time of the pandemic. The verse, give me the strength to do what I have to do. I think that's what gratitude's all about. What do you think? 